TIFU by telling my kid's three-year-old's friend not to aim the nerf gun at people. So for once on this sub. This actually happened about six hours ago today. I just got out of the emergency room. My son and his friend, both three years old, were playing with the nerf guns. And I told them, whatever we do, we don't point these at people, especially people's face. They listened for a bit. Until this kid decided, I think it would be funny to break the rules and shoot this guy in the face. So what does he do? He runs up to me and shoots me right in the face. Now I've had plenty of injuries. But never by a nerf gun. This dart hit me dead perfect in my right eyeball while my eye was open. Instantly. I went 100% blind in my right eye. After a few minutes. I realized this was serious. So I went to urgent care. The doctor at urgent care looked more nervous than I did and immediately sent me to the ER. I get to the ER. Spend 6 hours there by the time I get out. But I did regain about 10% of my vision since then. And the docs say I should get it back within a few days. Hopefully. But the docs also told me, this is why you don't let kids play with nerf guns. Quote. Touche I guess. Wish me luck on my road to recovery. TLDR. Kid shot me in the eye with a nerf gun after specifically saying don't shoot people in the face. Caused immediate blindness in my right eye. Which will hopefully come back. For now. I'll wear my eye patch and say arg. For ages 8 and up. I always viewed that as a warning to kids not to play with it. Now I know it's a warning to the parents. And that makes a lot of sense. Kids don't read warning labels. I work in a daycare and live in the same neighborhood as a lot of my students. A few years ago somebody had the bright idea to give the neighborhood kids a bunch of Nerf guns at a street party. Over a dozen children aged 214 running round the street with Nerf guns while their parents sat back and drank. Recipe for disaster. I wasn't going to get involved. None of these kids belong to me and I'm not on the clock. Until one of my students shot me point blank in the face. Luckily he didn't hit anything important. I told him not to point the gun at my face or at anybody's face. When he didn't listen and lined up for another shot. I took the gun and returned it to its owner. Then I gave his mother the heads up and left her to deal with the tantrum. She got him another gun and he immediately shot his baby cousin in the face. Gave her a bloody nose and a black eye. Two days later the mother tried put in a complaint with my boss. Apparently I was abusing my authority and power over her child and undermining her as a parent. My boss asked her why she let her three-year-old have a gun and why she gave him another one when he proved he couldn't listen and play with them safely. They moved to another center and still avoid me in the street. The real foo is giving your three-year-old and his friend nerf guns. Also you should know that telling a three-year-old not to do something will very likely result in that something happening. When we were younger, one of the neighborhood kids ran up to my older brother with a super soaker and said, I'm going to squirt you. Quote, my brother told him, if you spray me, I'm smashing your gun off the fence. Kid sprayed my brother. My brother grabbed the gun by the nozzle, took it out of his hands, and smashed it on the fence behind him, breaking it, and handed it back, naturally. The kid started crying and went and told his father. His father came and spoke to ours about what happened. My dad said. He told him what would happen. Jeez. You're doing it all wrong. You have to teach them gun safety with a real. Loaded firearm. Kids just don't take nerf very seriously. If they were older, it would be a lesson that will stick with them for a lifetime. When I was a toddler, my mom was trying to take my temperature and told me not to bite down on the thermometer. Guess what I immediately did? And where we had to go? Toddlers are weird. 
man. You need to make an appointment with an ophthalmologist, not an optometrist, ASAP. The ER doc is most likely not a specialist when it comes to eye injuries and that is what you need. Don't mess around with the peepers. Or say, aim safely at a cardboard box, little kids can't process, don't. Another reason to not have kids added to the pile. You'll shoot your eye out, kid. Nerf guns seem like a terrible toy for a three-year-old. Three years old is way too young for any type of gun toy. I don't have any kids myself. But I check the age recommendations when buying my nieces and nephews gifts and I don't think I saw anything other than bubble-blowing guns for that age. I'd keep the eye patch on for longer than you really need to and make a point to refer to the fact. Said kid blinded me until it hits home that what they did could have had permanent life-altering consequences. Nerf or nothing. For the record you get my upvote for just being a today post lol. I hope your eye gets better quickly. I played that humans vs zombies game in college. And a friend of mine took a velcro dart to the eye. He went to the hospital for that. Last I heard. He can still feel the abrasion on his eye when he blinks. Since small we have always told them it's not okay to point it at someone's face. We also have a rule that if the person isn't wearing safety glasses. We bought in bulk off Amazon. That it's not okay to shoot them at all. A lot of problems have been avoided because they know if we want to play we will put glasses on. I distinctly remember being a kid playing with Nerf guns with my cousin and sister and her nailing me right in the eye. No blindness luckily. My wife got a scratched cornea and it was incredibly painful. You need to follow up with an ophthalmologist to get the surface debrided before it heals bumpy. It was so painful. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Eracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.